All right since we are live all right so um today um let's solve another five questions so um the first question would be remove the nth node from the end of the list so um so it gives you a link list and you will have to remove the um the end no from the end of the list and return um the hat so um so the way i would approach to this problem is to have a two pointer um one is slow one is fast and then we just um we just increment um our fast pointer by end no so uh when it reach to the end Oh, so we will first inc we'll have two steps. The first step would be um, to increment until the the interval between the slow pointer and the fast pointer is uh, with n. So um, so for this sample, so this question would be like one, two, three, four, five. So we would initialize like um. um we would have a left and right pointer. So uh, let's say if n equals to two, for example, um, maybe like n is equal to two. In this case, we just keep shifting um, our pointer right to 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 the next. Um, to the next node so that it has uh, the interval is 2 and when it reached to the end we just remove our uh, we just remove the end we just remove the the node next to the left pointer so that way we remove the end node from the end of the list so that's the, the concept for this question um, so Let's write the code. Um, the first step would be uh, first to have two pointers with interval interval n. So, um, so we can initialize our um, left pointer would be. So we can have a, a, a dummy create a dummy node. Um, so this node, um, this case, and we can have uh, our next is equals to hat this case, and our left pointer would equals to dummy, and right would be um dummy dot next right um or we can call this slow pointer and fast pointer okay and while um so as long as the fast pointer is not null we just keep um shifting um and also we need an n if a n is larger than zero and fast is not um, no, uh, we just um, keep shifting our pointer. So fast would equal to fast dot next, um, and n minus equals to one. So this way uh, we will have the. The slow pointer and the fast pointer with interval n, and then we would um, and then we would need to um, shift our left pointer and right pointer and to the end. So um so while fast 
and fast on next. Um, um, slow pointer would be slow dot next, and the fast pointer would be fast dot next dot next. Right, so that way we would um, reach to the end of the, the the list, and then we just need to um, remove the end node um, in that case. So if all this finished, we just um, the snow the slow dot next would be slow dot next dot next. And that's where we we remove the 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 end node from from this equation because the slow dot next now is equal to dot next dot next. So we remove basically we remove the this this node. Um. Yeah, and then we just we should just return. Um. We should just return dummy. That next so I think it should be should be like this alright so I guess all this need to be shifted One, two, three, five, one, three, four, five. So seems like I have some pointer issues. So Just, I think it's the same, right? The head, and uh, we just um, keep shifting, and and we move to um, Oh, I think we need to move our slow pointer once after all this. So, um, right? Or did I? Oh no! Or did I do wrong? Should I do? Oh, so I figured. So here, since we want to shift our um, fast pointer and, and the left pointer and right, we want to keep the distance of n, so we only move one step for the um for the the fast pointer. So uh, remember to move the fast pointer just by one in here as we want to keep distance and all right so that's why seriously 
so loud, fast. Just wild fast. It is something like Okay, so since we only move, since in here we only move one step, so we don't need really need to check if the first dot, a fast dot next is also um, exists. That's usually when you have uh, really like a fast pointer. You need to make sure. You don't have a num value, otherwise there will be an error that is saying that num doesn't have the next. So uh, that's 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 this one. All right, and the next question is copying the list from random pointer. So this one is like uh, um, basically we'll have to create like a a copy of it. So it also has two steps. Um, the first step would be we will create a copy for each node and uh, we just storage their pair uh, in a dictionary. So we would have the old node as a key and the value would be the new 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 node that we just um, created. And also we would run uh, and the second stage would be connecting them so uh, but when we are connecting them we are trying to um, using the, the key and we trying to pair um, copy all the link between the, the next and the random to to uh, using our dictionary so and also there's one special case is like the, the node, this node, we would also need to um, copy so that way when we are mapping, um, the, the node would map into the node. So basically it's like treated as a, a, a node as well. So, uh, so we can call it auto new map or just auto new is fine and like i said we would have to have a we have to have a copy for this node just to know right and um, and what else we just um This while um, so we can uh, have a as long as it's not null, we just uh, keep um, copied and uh, mapping it to the auto new list. So um, copy would equals to um, current dot um, value right and we want to have a, a node node right and uh, we haven't have any uh, and we, this is the copy and we want to put our um, old old to new um, copy and then we need to move our pointer 
and after all this we should have all the node with uh, all the copy and we also store it uh, into our uh, hash map here then we would um, we would connect in them so what we would do it over again so uh, let's set it to head and while it's not empty um, we can get the current node um, so Right, so we would get the current node and the current node. Um, would be this one. Um, dot next, and also dot random. We would have uh, this one. random right um, so that we finished our setup we just need to move our pointer next um, And I think that should be it, right? Um, we can just return the old to new. Um, of hat, right? So we, so this will be the the copy of um hat, right? The head of the copy, so. Let's see if it works. For some reason, I didn't update our, my pointer correctly. Alright. Let's go. So it's also big O of N and big O of N memory. Um, this one is two pointers, but it's like uh, a, a, a two pass. So also big O of N, and we don't have any um memory, so constant time memory. Right. Um, what's this one? Uh, two numbers, so this question is like it gives you list one, list two, and you should perform the addition for the number. So, for example, for the list one is two, four, three, and list two is five, six, four, you should is up but in, in a reverse order. So, um, so basically, we would have a uh, um, a value one from this one and the value two from this two and we just need to um, sum them up and we have to if they have the uh, value so if if it's like um, so it should give you some example so for this uh, we should keep adding the zero um so this should be um nine 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 plus 
um, nine, 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 and then we put um, and we put all the zero in front of it, so it would become like something like like this, right? Um, I don't know how many it has, but but you should um, see it. it should be like in the return the the number we should get is like We have to reverse it, so it should be looks like nine, 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 zero, 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 and so it becomes eight. And we perform the addition is eighteen, and one plus nine plus nine is nine, and it's nine, and it's. And what's this one? So, 18, 19, 19, is also 19, and plus 1 is equal to 0, and 1 plus 9 is equal to 0 again. And this is also 1, and so this is the result, right? So, um, so we would have to um, give it a zero if there is a, if there if the the length of the list is empty. It's now we just keep adding the zero and we perform um, the addition in this case. So um, yeah, and also there is some eight cases like if you only have like eight and nine. Uh, when we perform the addition, like they say it's 17, but we have like 0 and 0 here. Uh, when we're doing the, the loop, we should remember there's still a carry over, which is 1 in this case. So it should be 1. And here should like, so it should return the 17, right? So, um, so just remember this two H cases. Um, yeah, so I think that should be should be it. So initially we could have a carry just one and while uh, while it's not empty, uh, we just uh, we just keep perform the addition, right? So. Uh, it's like l one dot value val if a one else um else else zero because we have to have a zero and this is the l two dot valve if l two else zero so um then we can perform the addition here the value be v one plus v2 plus carry right so the remainder would be value um modded 10 so it gives you let's say if it's like 17 it will give you 7 and the carry would be the value divided by 10 uh, this is the uh the integer uh, so it will be one or zero in this case um, and then we would um, we would have to have a, a node right so um, so we can create the dummy node um, list node um, yeah. 
Okay, so dummy. Uh, the next would be the list. Um, so we should keep adding the remainder to the to the node. Um, so it would be this this node node node. Right. So next node. Dummy. The next would be uh, the next node, and we have to update our uh, next. So, um. What else we need to check? Um, then we need to move our pointer from um, From from the list, if this one our next is not empty, else just none. I think we don't need. Uh, So that way um, we update our, our list one and list two, right? Um, and after all this, we can just return dummy. Okay. So um so use the dummy node uh as a ring like it's remember the first and we just using another pointer to up to to reconstruct the list and we can just return the dummy the next that is a pretty common technique for solving all the linked list uh, questions so so yeah so that's this question the next one is the linked list cycle so it asks you to return true if there's a cycle return false if there's none so um so this question we actually need to use the fluid um the the turtle and the rabbit algorithm i don't know um how to say that but it's like a, a slow pointer and the fast pointer so um if there's a, a loop in, in the linked list uh eventually the the slow pointer will only goes one and the fast pointer would go to two so if there's a loop, uh, the fast pointer would catch up the slow pointer 
it means that it has a loop. Otherwise, the fast pointer will just reach to the end, and it's never, um, it will never chase uh, the slow pointer. So uh, we could uh, initialize our slow pointer is equals to head, and our fast pointer is also to head. And while um, fast pointer is not empty, we just keep shifting our pointer, right? So slow down next. And also be careful uh, in here, we need to make sure the fast down next is also available because we are going to move our fast pointer uh, two steps. So you have to make sure here you don't give any like non value, otherwise, it gives you error. And if slow is ever equals to fast means that um, there is a loop, so that's why they are meeting each other again. Um, so we can just return true, and after all this, uh, we can just um, we can just return false in this case because um, because. It's reached to like a null and they never uh, meet each other, so it means there's no loop inside the uh, link list. So let's run. There you go. So submit it. Okay. So pretty efficient. Um, and this one, the find duplicate number. So I ask you to find the duplicate number in this array, um, in this list. So it's not like a, 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 a it looks like an array questions, but actually uh, a linked list question because uh, because initially, if we want to solve this question, we would just maybe create a hash map and we just uh, see if there's any duplicate number and we just return it, right? But it asks you, you don't, you can't, and you have to have constant memory and you cannot modify um, the array. So um, basically you cannot use the array as uh, some kind of like, like uh, memory. So this question is basically um, a, the question from like the one we just previous saw. So if we treat um all this number as a index that is pointing to the um to the list. So for example, when we look over this, we we, we may have like a two pointers and uh, slow pointer and the fast pointer. So the so every time we go to the desired index because it's bounded. So, um, like this question, for example, this has five elements. So the n is like, uh, the maximum will be four because there must have some um. Uh, it's bounded, so uh, we can definitely find the index uh, within this list, right? So. So the first node is 1, it's pointing us to 3, and we go to 3, it's pointing us to the, 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 the 3, it's going to 2, and 2 is leading us to, to, to 4, and 4 is leading us to 2, and 2 leading us to 4, and 4 is leading us to, so you can see here, we, we have a loop here. So, uh, so the, the first step would be, we would have to find when we, uh, when we found, when we have the um, which point we start the loop, then we would need to find uh, when is the beginning from um, from the loop. So, um, so this question is pretty hard. I don't think I can ever. Uh, remember this one but basically um, whenever we detect there's a <coughs> there's a, um, a loop happened then we would um, 
how would how would we know the the uh, the number that is repeated is when you start from the beginning and uh, start from your um, slow pointer, they should travel the 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 equal distance. So um, so I don't know how to prove it, <laughs> but uh, I just I would just probably have to memorize this question. Um, so. That's right. So we can have a slow pointer and a fast pointer that is equals to zero. Um, zero, zero. Maybe. And we just, um, just use the um, wild fast and the fast uh, fast um, okay we can wild true um, so the slow would be arms um, of Low, right, and fast would be uh, fast. Fast would be like this. So this way, it's um, we shift our pointer by its value, right? So and um, if And then we would have another loop is starting from the beginning and while um, also while true, All right? Um, Uh, we just have to um, begin would be nums of begin right and slow would be nums of slow right and if begin equals to slow we just return nums slow. Oh, we just return the slow because that's our index. Um, yeah. So since it's guaranteed to find the duplicate, so we can make sure this we don't have infinite loop. Um, so that should be the code. Okay, so it has the test. So, um, so I think the tricky part is you will have to know this. Basically, um, you will have to know the distance, the distance between the start point, point, and uh, to the goal point would 
be the same as the slope point to the goal, goal point. That's when you would found the duplicates uh, or the the starting point from uh, the the starting point from the from the loop. So in this case would be this Q. So um, imagine that for this one. Uh, you would find some you would have like a zero because the index the first is index zero and you would go to the index um, index three then you would then go to you starting from the index zero it tells you go to um, index one and one tells you go to three and three tells you go to go to two and two tells you go to four and four tells you go to two you know and the loop just continue right so 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 we need to find so this two is actually the starting for the loop because it would just keep going on and on right two go to here and four go to here you know so we need to find this point and which is is two so um so the so the very first step would be make sure we found uh, um, a loop and we just stop right there um, the slow point. So the first step would be find the find the slow pointer pointer location and find the intersect. Do to Okay, so I made it so I can have the the save the com comments. Yeah, so this is this five question today. So, um, yeah, it's um it's very hard. Um, and the good news we are approaching to the trees. So, I think I would probably just do. I don't know if I would finish all of them um, because some of them is very hard. Uh, I would probably just do some. I don't know. Uh, we will see. So let me see if I have any viewers. Uh, I don't know. Uh, we will see. So let me see if I have any viewers. Uh, right, I guess not. I don't know. Uh, we will see. All right. Um, just keep 